steady as she is, no close to the bank. Your duty ends in a quarter of an hour. I want you to carry on for another two hours on your own. Yes, Sulis Pa. Thank you. Thank you. You've learned quickly, Manuel. I shall raise your wages to 40 mil race. Thank you, Sulis Pa. Can I have the money? What's given you that idea? Oh, the cook's boy gets real money. Cook's boy's a confounded nuisance. He's no example to anyone. I shall keep your money until you've learnt the value of it. It is like having a garden where nothing grows. Your account grows. Don't rack your brains with things you don't understand and keep your mind on your duties. We've got passengers on board. You've got to be doubly careful when there are passengers. Keep her out a little. Now I shall make up the log. And your account. Yes, Sulis Boer. Sulis Boer? Yes? I don't like passengers. Oh, you don't? They think when they pay for their tickets, everything belongs to them. Well, in a way, it does. While they're on board, everything is for their use and comfort. Not everything. <laughs> What the devil you doing? I'll wring your neck. Well, this I don't feel well. You were all right a minute ago. I feel sick. That's no reason for sinking the ship. Don't you ever dare leave the wheel again. Here, you take over. Your spell isn't finished yet. You can go now. Better get to bed at once if you're sick. He <laughs> doesn't look very sick, does he? No, senor. Teresa! Manuel! I didn't know it was you. I thought it was that awful man coming back again. Oh, I am sorry. Come in here before someone sees you. If you aren't dried, you'll have fever. I was afraid you liked the man, the passenger. Teresa, there's something between you and Manuel, isn't there? Yes. Well, do you want to get married? Married? I don't know. We haven't thought about it. Well, don't you think you'd better? Why, please? We're very happy. But you can't just decide to go on being happy, like a pair of birds. Why not? What's wrong with birds? There's nothing wrong with birds, Manuel. Only you don't happen to be birds. We don't want to be married. Thank you. Of course you do. Don't you want to make a home? Yes. When I'm married, when I made a home, will I get my money? I shall take even greater care of your money when you're married. You neither of you know how to spend wisely. It is not so with my people. When a man takes a wife, he's no more a child. I have a good mind to wash my hands of the whole affair and have done with you and your... Let's take things one by one. We were speaking of marriage. You don't want to marry Manuel. Very well. But then, of course, you won't be able to see so much of Teresa. We can't have the passengers talking. That's right. We must think of the passengers. 
It is I who love Teresa, not the passengers. All right, my love. Cut along back to the bridge now. I won't marry Teresa. Then someone else will. Now, ladies and gentlemen, hold it please for a photograph. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. them at all. Why not, Father? The boy is a wicked heathen. No, Father. He may be an Indian. He may be primitive. But he's not wicked. He made a terrible confession. In cold blood. Manuel? I can't believe it. What has he done? It wasn't anything he had done, but something he had omitted to do. Has he ever spoken to you of Mr. and Kanaima? No, why? Confession is secret. Alfredo Lisboa, as a good son of the Holy Church, I tell you to pray for his salvation, to guard him. Yes. Trepa no coqueiro, tira coco de pigi pinha cunhaco no coqueiro, olirá. Trepa no coqueiro, tira coco de pigi pinha cunhaco no coqueiro, olirá. Papai, cadê Maria? Maria foi passear. Papai, cadê Maria? Maria foi passear. Olha os passeios de Maria. Faz papai e mamãe chorar. Olha os passeios de Maria. Faz papai e mamãe chorar. Trepa no coqueiro, tira coco de pigi pinha cunhaco no coqueiro, olirá. Lá, lá, lá. Trepa no coqueiro, tira coco de pigi pinha cunhaco no coqueiro, olirá. Maria é moça nova, sorteira não tem juízo. Maria é moça nova, sorteira não tem juízo. Os passeios de Maria só pode dar prejuízo. Os passeios de Maria só pode dar prejuízo. Três trepa no coqueiro, tira coco de pigi pinha cunha como coqueiro olirá lá lá lá. Trepa no coqueiro, tira coco de pigi pinha cunha como coqueiro olirá. I'm sorry to break up the party, but we sail in ten minutes. Oh. Well, how does it feel to be a married man? Too many people kiss the bride. <laughs> it's harmless fun, Manuel. You must learn to see the lighter side of life. Don't take yourself too seriously. It's good to laugh at times and chuck your troubles overboard. Won't you try? How old are you? I don't know. Did your mother never tell you? In my country, no one pays any attention to such things. Well, you'll have to have an age. Couldn't you give me one? You might be 20 or 21. I'll be 21. All right. Now run along to your wife. And remember what I told you. I will, Sue Lisboa. You're like Pedro. Pedro? He was my brother. Oh.
A lovely night dress for the lady. Straight from London, straight from England, the best British silk. Mixed, of course, with the best Indian cotton. <laughs> no, thank you. Something for the gentleman. Something nice in shirts. This one. The finest silk known, finer even than British silk. Imported by me from China and offered at a price that no shop could compete with. I have no overhead, sir. Ten mil rays takes it. It is beautiful. A single occasion, a last opportunity, ten mil rays. No, we haven't got ten mil rays. I can get it from Lisboa. Then go to your Lisboa, my friend. For a small deposit, I will keep it for you. I have only a mil rays now. What about the lady? Well, I have got a mil rays. Splendid. No doubt the beautiful lady will lend you hers. Two mil rays will keep it for you. I'll give you a receipt. The gentleman likes the smell of my hair. Queen Brillantine of the Brothers Brunier. It comes from France. She? Eh? She? Yes. How much? Oh, no, we haven't got the money. Fifteen mil race the bottle of the Brothers Roger. No one brother could conceive this. Smell it, my friend. Smell it, my lady. Beautiful. As I have the bottle open, I will let you have a sample. Here is the comb. The lady will hold the mirror for you. Do you really like it? I never had a fine thing like that on my hair. She did. About that money. It's yours. You've earned it. But if I give it to you, it'll be gone like a puff of smoke. Two mil race have puffed already. I like the silk shirt. Look, my son. It's the first time you've been in a big city. There are men here who live by robbing people of their cash, with their tricks, and their cheap, useless junk, like that silk shirt of yours. I'll bet it hasn't got a month's wear in it. Make you look like a monkey on a barrel organ. Only you'll smell worse. Well, here it comes, I saw. I have paid a deposit, and I want to have it. I have a surprise for you. Just by chance, I found the right thing. Cut the string, Alfredo. Two very strong ones for working, and this one if you want to dress up. Not the kind I want. What? I like the silk one. Oh, my mother, it was such a poor one. And these... You they... said you liked it. I didn't, really. Come back, Manuel. Let him go, Teresa. Manuel, please, don't quarrel with Lisboa. He's so good to us. He likes you. Likes me? Likes to work me without giving me any cash. Oh, he puts it away for you. How do I know? Come, I will get you something to eat. I don't want to eat. Well, you'll come back sooner than I expected, senor. Have you got the money? Lisboa won't give it me. Who is this Lisboa, your father? He's the captain of the Tupan. I earned the money. He says he's keeping it for me. Keeping it? Are you politically minded? Yes, I can see you are. You dislike being a poor caboclo. You dislike being a serf living in poverty. You dislike bosses who say they'll take care of your money. Now look here, do you want to you buy want something? You want to sell that shirt? Sure. And you want to buy it? Yes, senor. Come with me. Yes, senor. There are green shirts and black shirts. All sorts of shirts. If I were you, I'd lay in a good stock of this material. with me. 